What's up, guys? It's Dave Kim for WGRD.com and Grand Rapids Rock Alternative 97.9 GRD. 20th anniversary of Lollapalooza at Grand Park. Well, 20th anniversary of the festival. I am at Grand Park in Chicago. And the weather uh, kind of took a turn for the worse. It's raining right now. Uh, the clouds look very pissed off. But uh, still, uh, a lot of great music to be had. Tonight, Foo Fighters are one of the big headliners, along with uh, Kid Cudi. He'll be uh, hosting the Perry stage. Cold War Kids will be at the Google Plus stage. Um, and then uh, Dead Mouse will be at uh, they're headlining the Bud Light stage. Uh, of course, I want to see Foo Fighters. Um, they are, are also going on tour this fall. But I think it would be cool to see them at Lollapalooza despite the rain. Hopefully, it blows over by the time uh, 8 o'clock comes around. Last night was great as well. Uh, started off the day uh, seeing uh, Death From Above 1979. They're a Canadian uh, indie rock punk band. Um, they broke up like five years ago. They went on hiatus like for five years. But they came back this year, reformed, and uh, they brought a high energy. Deftones played across the street from them, or not across the street, but across the grass from them at the PlayStation stage. I just wrote a review at WGRD.com. They were awesome. Chino had a lot of high energy. Uh, they just they did a great set. Um, then uh, Eminem, they were, uh, uh, he had a lot of special guests. Uh, Bruno Mars came out. Uh, Royce to 5'9", you know, they had the bad meets evil. They reunited. They uh, buried their beef. Um, and then uh, Skylar Gray, she uh, did a little uh, cameo as well for the I Need a Doctor hook. Uh, great crowd, I swear. There were, from reading the reports, there were like fifty to 60,000 people watching Eminem. Um, and that's probably one of the biggest crowds. Last year, when Saw Garden played, I'm there, I can tell you, guaranteed, not that many people came out. So some people will hate that, some people will love that. But it was a great set. The only gripe I had is that uh, he didn't play uh full songs like he went through like without me lose yourself or uh no without me um uh the way i am a few other songs that i really like not in its entirety just uh did a verse then went to the next song which i understand has a have a lot of uh time limit issues so he wanted to get as many songs as he could but it was still a great set uh so uh saturday great night today despite the weather hopefully um, it'll die down. I want to see Foo Fighters kick ass. And uh, they actually played a secret show at the Metro, which is like a 1,100 capacity venue, I think, uh, last night. So uh, I don't know. If it gets too bad, you know what? I can see them at the Palace September 19th uh, in Auburn Hills. But uh, hopefully I will see them tonight. I will have more updates at WGRD.com. It's Dave Kim at Lollapalooza getting wet in the rain at Grand Park in Chicago for Grand Rapids Rock Alternative 97.9 GRD.